listen, there's different kinds of diets, okay? There's different kinds of diets. I'll give you a few diets I've gone on, okay? <laughs> One diet I went on is uh, I was 25 years old, 24, 25 years old, went to Highland uh, in Hollywood. Club had just opened up. This is 18 years ago, 19 years ago, and it was like the place to be. I went there, one of my friends, uh, ex was there with another guy, and he goes to say hi to the girl, the ex comes, pushes him, we got into a big fight, and beer bottles being thrown, I'm on top of a guy, it's pretty nasty, <laughs> cops show up, they arrest, they, they have all of us in like, uh, what do you call it? Okay. Handcuffs, Custody, right? yeah. And I said to the cop, I said, listen, you gotta let me go, you'll, I, sw- I said, you let me go, I swear to God, you'll never see me here ever again. He says, what do you mean? I said, I have big plans in my life, you gotta let me go. I'm telling you, I swear to God, you will never see me here ever again. I don't know why the cop let me go. Just got the chills. My, look, look, I, look, I, look, I see it. That's fucking amazing. Look at that right there. That's my amazing. entire body just got chills. Wow. I said, I swear to God, you will never see me here ever again. I never went back again. Mm-hmm. Clubs was out of my life. I've been on a club diet <laughs> since then. Yeah. When I was uh, going and doing this Bible study with this guy in Pas- Pasadena, I heard this one guy talk about the fact that going on a sex diet. And for me, my biggest obsession was women at the time. That was my biggest distraction. So guess what I did? No sex, 17 months. You know how hard that is for a guy that that's like his- How old are you? Are you? I'm 24 oh, years God, old. Oh, that's Jesus. insane. I yeah. give you credit. So I go. Now, that happens, and I went on a pure, mm-hmm. I'm done. Yeah. Don't how, call 17 me. 17 months? 17 months. That's You've fucking... done the same thing 17 months, but it wasn't like uh, your own decision. That was No, just... my pickup line was just <laughs> shit. It was horrible. It's like, hey, I keep highly going, doubt it. If you've seen Vinny's pictures, Vinny's one of the most handsome guys you'll I love see. You. Very Stop. good looking guy. But, Stop. But, but the point is, so I went on that diet. Okay. Next diet. The diet was I am no longer having the lightweight conversations with people that all they want to do is bitch and complain about life mm-hmm. and blaming everybody. I'm going on a diet. When friends who were constant complainers, negative, being around other people that blame their bosses, blame everybody, I said, dude, we can't do lunch anymore. This would be the last time. That was a third diet. Then when I wanted to get married and I wanted to live a life of being married with kids, I had a single diet. Then I said, I can't hang out with single people anymore Mm -hmm. because your language of a single person is a single person's language. A single person talks in a different way than a married person does. If I have aspirations of having a family, I'm going on a singles diet. It doesn't matter. No matter where you are right now, whatever your vice is today, if it's video games, if it's women, if it's drugs, if it's alcohol, if it's whatever you got, it's time to go on your diet and not tell nobody about it until two, three years later when you're winning, kicking everyone's ass, then you say, here's what I did the last three years. Mm -hmm. Because while you're going through it, no one cares. So he went on a diet, definitely not the 17-month diet, but he (laughs) went on a diet, and a diet he went on got him to have a million dollars in cash savings. Good for him. But there's a diet you go through with that. Okay, His diet could have been cars. His diet could have been different types of things, right? Mm -hmm. But people can say whatever they want to say. The the one reality when you're looking at the stat about a quarter million dollar earners, not the 50, Look, there's a very simple philosophy that I go by. Nothing lasts forever. Let me explain what I mean by that. If you're winning and you're making, say this is your biggest, you make a million eight, don't assume you're going to make a million eight for the rest of your life. Facts. Assume that million eight is really $300,000, save $700,000 of it, set it aside. If you're on top of the world and you're the hottest girl and you're attractive 22, 23 years old and you're at Mm -hmm. your peak, let me tell you something. You are never going to look as good as you do today, okay? If you're the 26 year old with the abs, the muscles, all this stuff, you're like, oh, look, 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 look. Okay, you ain't gonna look that like forever, okay? Eventually, those looks are gonna go away. This doesn't mean I'm, I'm in the best shape I've been since I was 24 years old, and I feel great. But I'm not, I don't look like I did when I was 21, 22, 23 years old, not even close on what I looked like at that age, and I'm totally fine with it. Military, top-notch shape. I'm not in that shape today, right? So nothing lasts forever. However, one thing does. Legacy, history, doing something big that's written about and talked about. The only way you and I get to live forever is by the legacy we leave behind with the work that we do professionally, with the kids that we raise, with the relationships that we build, with the companies that we build, with the books that we write, with the articles that we write that make an impact on people's lives. That's one way where you can live forever. All this other stuff that people are chasing, one day, they're going to go away. And you're going to sit there and you're going to realize, what currency was really the most valuable? What the hell was I doing so obsessed about that thing? Man, I'm so over it. 
I want to go live a big life. So pick and choose your diet, whichever one it is, then go light it up. So if you like this clip and you want to watch another one, click right here. And if you want to watch the entire podcast, click right here.